But you take it stills now? No, you're being on you're on video, so you can say something real witty. Uh huh. Witty and look at yourself. Now do something mm -hmm. cute. Talk about the earthquake. <laughs> yeah, you know we just had a 6.0 earthquake hit. Boy, I was scared. Yeah, yeah. I can't tell. I could tell you, I was so scared, and and Joe Paul blamed it on me. <laughs> he, right. Joe he Paul thought you were shaking the beer. That's right. He said I shook the dog. <laughs> yeah. He said. Alex, why are you shaking the beer? <laughs> we were in that little screen house and Stell said, what was that? And, you know, I thought it was a big gust of wind that come along. That's what I thought. But then I looked at the trees and I said, Wait a minute. You know, yeah, there's no wind. And then, uh, you know, not being from Look California or there. someplace <laughs> like that or Japan, it suddenly said, I think you said it. It was an earthquake. Yeah, so check that. Though. Yeah, who would have thought an earthquake, though? I, I didn't know what it was. I don't think they have earthquakes in this area, right? Not normally. Well, there was a... Uh, uh, Someone said last year on Facebook when he went and checked out all his Facebook pals, they said there was one last year. Yeah, I had... There was a 3.0 or 3.5 in Columbia, Maryland. Uh, I think during the winter. And I had just woken up, and uh, I had just woken up and was lying in my bed, and I just kind of felt like this like vibration in the bed, you know. And I said, well, "That's weird." It was like I thought a big truck had gone by outside or something like that, you know. Mm -hmm. And uh, then when I uh, was driving into work, I heard that there was a 3.0 at exactly the time I felt that, you know. It was on the news. Yeah, and, we had a similar uh, situation up in Chicago land where there was an earthquake in one of the suburbs and I was up going to the bathroom in the middle of the night and felt the shaking. I thought it was me, you know. Right, right. You thought you were just losing your balance, right? <laughs> yeah, but it, was, uh, but it was mild, you know. It, uh, even at the epicenter it wasn't bad, but the thing about the Midwest is it's, it's got one of the nastiest earthquake faults in North America, the New Madrid Fault. It takes a while. Mm. I mean, it hasn't blown it seriously since about 1814 or something like that. Is that but, the one that got, like kind of goes down the Mississippi Valley? Yeah, when it, when it blew in the early 19th century, it changed the whole course of the river. And right. People wasn't there like a wasn't there a town that almost like disappeared or something? Could be. Um, I think down in like Tennessee or something along the river. Because it was built on, yeah, every time I do it, I start on ground that was like saturated with water, and when you, sh if you shake, mm -hmm. like the town just like sunk into the ground. Sounds definitely possible. Wow. You know, if we suck all the photons out of the sky, people better watch this to put them back in, because <laughs> everything will go dark. <laughs> <laughs> Are you producing those anti-photons again, Alex? And, uh, and, Mark, and I, I Mark sitting, came down just a little while ago. I was ago, sitting but... on the dock, and it started to shake, and I just thought it was the reverberations from Joe Paul and uh, Alex going at each other right. uh, about one thing or another that I didn't even understand. And so You I spent just, about an hour in the boat by. with those two, I said, right? I, I told Bobby as soon as I got out, it reminded me of an SDS meeting. <laughs> haven't, heard that much argu haven't heard that much arguing since, an, since I was in an SDS meeting. You don't vote on Cassie. Here's the owner. This is Mr. Alex, the owner. Yeah, lived through an earthquake. That was crazy. We're not going to be charged extra for this. I know. We? That was extra, you know, you didn't know I was going to put a little shake in your stay. So you lost some bottles of liquor? No, we actually didn't. They were coming out, though. We have a liquor cabinet, and then they were out over like a good inch. So, you so I told Jamie, them to be safe. push them back before we get an aftershock. Ooh, that or drink them. Save the liquor, yeah, push them back. And a couple pitchers were a little cockeyed, so we had to go in the cottages and fix them. <laughs> Oh, yeah. what an experience. That was yeah, fun. Yeah, that was. <laughs> but you were inside that shed, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I thought so. <laughs> I tell you, well, it must have felt like the roof was about to fall in on you. Oh, it did. It shook because it has the, the uh, garage door opener over to it, and that was going clink, 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 clink. That's what I really <laughs> noticed. <laughs> oh, what fun. <laughs> oh, hey, that was good, Gabrielle. <laughs> Let me see that again. Oh. Let's see it again. Mm. I know Chris was out in the water, didn't feel nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard now. Oh,
Everybody can watch it. Oh, we're not here. They emptied out the White House, the Capitol, all those buildings. Wait, wait, wait. Say, so, what was it again? 6.7. 6.7? Centered uh, northwest of Richmond, Virginia. Apparently, they evacuated the White House, the Capitol, Pentagon, all those government buildings. They said people poured out in the streets in downtown D.C. Those cock brothers. Yeah, I mean, 6.7 is really. No. It's like. Uh, How far is Richmond, Richmond Virginia, from the about 100, White House? About 120, 120 miles. I mean, because anything yeah, over 6.0 is like a major earthquake in California. Uh-huh. Yeah. See, we're actually, I think we're closer to Richmond. Well, maybe not. I don't know. You yeah. can't get there from here. No, it's, uh, there's a, <laughs> well, you could. <laughs> you got all the way down to the tip of Maryland, which I don't think I've ever even been to. And there's some big bridge tunnel thing down there. So, so I guess the Chesapeake Bay doesn't cushion the shock that much. I don't care. Maybe it did. Oh, maybe it did. That's Maybe right. It could have been a lot worse. It could have been a lot worse. That's right. We yeah. could We're have lucky to be alive. That's all I can say. We're just we'll lucky. Find out if they damaged the Bay Bridge, then we'll I mean, even if it wasn't. I'm lucky to be alive. I'm lucky to be alive. Having been on a boat morning. ride right. with Alex. That's right. No. With the pirates, <laughs> Alex and Joe Paul, marauding Harris Creek. I didn't know who was the pirate. I just didn't know. I was just. I just kept quiet. Yeah. Well, there could, Get have my been, head down. there could have been damage to the bridge, but they don't know it yet, and they won't find out for days. The Bay Bridge, you mean? Yeah. Oh. Possible. Well, I'm going well, over it tonight, it so... So we got to get across it before they shut it down. Well, I'm going across it tonight, because <laughs> I'm going back tonight. You think you're going across Well, it. I was going back tonight. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's a long swim. I don't know if I'll be able to do that. All of a sudden, the dock started. I thought somebody ran the dock behind it on another boat. I mean, yeah, Pop says like. like a 5.9 or, so, or yeah. Mark says a 5.8. Five five you know, it's coming in different than Well, the North Korean uh, judges only gave it a 4. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the kids oh, have been I, paddling around. Now earthquakes are up subjectively interpreted. Yeah, it's too. like yeah, it's politically <laughs> decided how much of it. <laughs> I don't know, the place looks the same. It couldn't have been much of an earthquake. The tsunami <laughs> went out real quick. I mean, it was, it well, fortunately, it, it was based apparently near Richmond, Virginia, so it wasn't yeah. so bad around here. But they evacuated the White House, you said? Yeah. I just for a short time. That was I just think. a ploy. Yeah. Just they the wanted biggest. to bug his phone. <laughs> they said a WTOP, you know, which we would never question their, uh, their news gathering capabilities. Oh, come on, we have a movie. Your boat we can, we can out? Oh, I had my boat out. Uh, you, see my, you see my little boat? Oh. Here's Gabrielle. Miss Gabrielle is practicing her soccer. Mr. Angelo, I don't know what he's doing. He was playing frisbee. I am. I'm just standing. Here's Mr. Mike. Mr. Mike Jackson just came down from Baltimore. And Patty. Patty, where's Patty? This is Crago and Mark Woodard. Hey, hey. They're hanging out at the gazebo. This yep. is a really nice gazebo here. Shady with gazebo. Shady gazebo with fans. Gazebo. Screened in. This is where we're going to be eating the crabs later on. You, you're going to Julianne them? Julianne them. That comes from that woman, uh, Julianne, who invented the Roman Empire in 1978 or something like that. Yeah. Unbelievably, this is, this is our fearless leader. And if anyone knew us at the time in Maryland, to imagine that this would this is, all be led by Alex. This is the biggest thing I have ever uh, organized. And look how it's turned out. <laughs> Perfect weather. I got the weather. That's I got right. The earthquake. Got the earthquake. That's right. Yeah, but the, the food is a little harder. That's right. <laughs> But Did no, you guys have a group? Are called he Zucchini got geological stuff. events Did to uh, coincide with the uh, 
with the uh, momentous happening of this reunion. It took something like a... Oh, this isn't a reunion. Oh, no, training this... camp. <laughs> this is a revolutionary training camp. We're getting ready. We're getting ready. We've done the frisbee uh, attack frisbee. Uh, this is the brigade. The uh, kung fu soccer. That's right. The, the bloody horse. The brigadistas. There, there, there's the naval armada getting uh, prepared. Here's a brigadista coming, coming across the gravel. Yes. <laughs> I'm going to Julianne and Cook the. All right. Who's responsible for the? Uh, for the uh, crabs. Is that you? Uh, I, I can, I can. We I, need the spices and I guess we need to... Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Alex. Yeah, okay. the crabs because, you know, I think you've got, I think you've got a knack for crabs. Because <laughs> well, you I camera by the way. That was a very expensive camera. Was it? Yeah. And it's time. Whose is it, yours or Bobby's? <laughs> Mine. Oh. 35 bucks. Where'd you find it? Where'd you get it? Used uh, computer store. Nice. <coughs> it's Susie's uh, used computer store. Korean woman. You walk in, she says, I got a deal for you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's, 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 let's get the crab cake. Let's get the crab thing on the road here. Big away. Pardon? Who was it? Green Bay. Green Bay. That's scary. They play Baltimore right there. That's the game we went to. The championship right, game. It wasn't the championship okay, game before the championship. We were debating with, amongst my friends whether he went for the rapist or went for the murderer. Did you feel a little scary too? It's tough. That was a great game. That was a great game. That was a great game. You were from Illinois at Chicago. Yeah. But to this day, I I don't want to be in a meeting with those two because I just have this visceral. <laughs> They probably remember that you didn't go to rescue the flag, and that's part of the problem. <laughs> they broke SDS. Yeah. I mean, not just well, personally. Well, I wouldn't, I mean, you could, it, it was coming apart anyway. You yeah, could I know.